Good morning, everybody. It is six o'clock in the morning on Saturday, and I have a busy day so far planned. And don't mind me, I'm holding my night guard. I just woke up and put my workout clothes on to get ready to go for my walk. But first thing I'm going to do is feed the cats because they're hungry and acting up right now. Then I'm going to get a little bit of coffee to wake up a little bit. And then I need to go add a link to one of my videos that I have scheduled to load today. It's the fitness challenge. And then I um, need to leave like five minutes before seven because I am going to go and vote early. Hi, Phantom. <laughs> I am going to vote early. After that, I'm going to go on my walk. I'm going to go ahead from when I vote, the building that I vote in, I'm going to go for a different walk. I'm not quite sure if there's a trail <laughs> where I have planned. There's lines like there's tra a trail there, but I don't know if there is a trail. So it may be a little bit longer walk than I had planned. And then once I am finished with my walk, I'll come back home, probably eat some breakfast. And then I will start cleaning because today is cleaning day. So we'll be deep cleaning the dining room, the library, front room, and then the TV room. So please join me today as I deep clean those three rooms and then clean the rest of the house. shadows way too long you always thought that you were weak but babe you're wrong yeah you better step into the light just give it a try think that it's time you let that spark out you've been hiding in the shadows way too long Cause you're a work of art
since it is zone three, I am going to be pulling off my chair cover and sofa cover off of my TV room sofas and chair and putting those in the washer because it is time for me to do that according to my quarterly schedule, cleaning schedule. So I am first, of course, vacuuming out this one because it had a bunch of litter in the little creases of that chair and I dumped it over and then I'm just putting all the cushions back and I am taking off the pillow cases off of the blue pillows because it has been a couple months since I have washed those as well. So I'm going to just do the same thing, strip off everything off of the sofa and I really don't like doing this but it has to be done. The sofa is has feathers and I absolutely hate the feathers, but it is what it is. Once I finish doing all of this, you'll see me pull out the vacuum cleaner and vacuum up the floor because the cats were all eating the feathers that were coming loose off of the cushions. And then once I do that, I, I cover the cushions at one point with the blankets, the throw blankets, just to protect the feathers, basically. So, um, but that's what I'm doing right here. And then we'll move on to cleaning the house. And of course the camera quit recording when I was in the kitchen. So I ended up finishing up in the kitchen by cleaning off all the rest of the countertops and putting some baking soda in the refrigerator because it started to get a little stinky. And I also vacuumed and mopped the floor in the kitchen as well. And then we moved on into the dining room and we are starting off with a deep clean in there. And I'm not doing much with a coffee pot because I do have coffee in that coffee pot. So I am just going to move on from there and finish cleaning off the rest of the dining room. Te prendo la vela, 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 vela. Iluminamos nuestras vidas como velas, velas. Kinda new 
It is 12.20. I've been up since 5.30. I've been doing things all morning. As you've seen, walk, Starbucks, voting, cleaning. I've cleaned the front of the house, so I'm at a good stopping point to where I can upload some videos to the computer while I am eating lunch. I'm still trying to figure out what I'm going to have for lunch. 
it's probably going to be ramen not the healthiest but I ran out of jelly yesterday so I I could have a grilled cheese sandwich but I kind of don't want that so excuse the socks I'm <laughs> my feet finally got tired of being constricted with socks but all I have left to do for cleaning wise is the office the room I'm in right now the two bathrooms the two bedrooms and just a quick wipe down of the laundry room although I might wait to do that until tomorrow because I need to do laundry so why clean it down when I'm gonna dirty it up but as you saw with the laundry I'm washing the sofa cover and the chair cover and I have moved those into the dryer and I've put those on low heat for 60 minutes and I will pull them out to see what needs to be clean out the filter because I'm sure there will be feathers in the filter and I just wanted to kind of throw in here I have been sweating like no tomorrow while I'm cleaning this house the temperature in the house is set at 74 it, it's it, the humidity I think in the house is just over 50% I have to go look at the the, the thermometer barometer thing that I have out in the living room but I think when I was cleaning it I saw like that it was at a little around the 50% mark but I'm just hot I don't know if it's because of the the workout that I did wearing socks while I've been cleaning but even when I clean I get hot and sweaty so it but today it just seems worse I don't know what that's about I mean I'm literally dripping sweat as I'm bending over sweat is literally dropping off of me onto the furniture I'm cleaning so <laughs> it's whoever said cleaning was easy they haven't ever done a loss clean with me and my house is not that bad because I don't have any children it is just me and the cats and occasionally my mom will be here so the house really doesn't get that bad it gets a lot it gets dusty and there's a lot of hair because of the cats and me because when my hair is down my hair is actually like down to halfway down my back I just don't like my hair I want to get it cut <sighs> but that's a whole nother story on that one but um, so for those of you that find it difficult to clean the house today is one of those days for me where my knees hurt I'm hot and sweaty I don't want to clean the house but I need to so I know how you feel I'm cleaning the house despite the pain that I'm in despite not wanting to do it I just know I need to do it because it makes the house healthier to clean up all that dust and it just makes me feel better about being in the house that is not dust free because it's never going to be dust free with the carpet and the cats but but I feel you on cleaning it, it, it's it's a difficult task and like I said mine is not that difficult compared to some others but I am in a lot of pain my feet are really hurting and my knees are really hurting and I'm running out of energy so I'm gonna go eat lunch and try to get some energy and while I'm eating lunch I probably am gonna put Ghost Hunters back on it's the Ghost Hunters classic Discovery Plus finally um, was able to get all 13 seasons of Ghost Hunters and I'm so happy my one of my guilty pleasures for those of you that don't know it's watching all the Ghost Hunter type shows like Ghost Adventures uh, Kindred Spirits Ghost Hunters, um, the Dead the dead Files, although they're not really looking for ghosts, they're just the psychic and finding the history. I, I find all of that fascinating. <laughs> so that, that's one of my guilty pleasures is to watch those shows. So I love the fact that I'm able to watch all the classic Ghost Hunters and I'm on season three or four now. So I'm not sure where I'm at. But I'm so glad that they're back. So, lunch time. I'll be back 
to clean the rest of the house. But I'm tired. Oh, I still want to take a shower and take a nap. Okay, I've had lunch. It was ramen. I had some ice cream as well. And I'm going to get back to cleaning. So let's start with the office. And I am listening to the seven and a half deaths of Evelyn Hardcastle for the afternoon cleaning with me. The morning I was listening to Korean pop music on iTunes. So I had it playing through my TV in the living room and now I'm just going to go ahead and listen to the audiobook. My book club is meeting on Monday, so I need to finish the book. So that's what I ended up doing for what I was listening to. So in the office, we're just doing a quick, quick cleaning. And you see that one of the two of the cats are in there with me and Binks is lying in the cat tree. And I guess I woke him up when I went over there, but we are going to go ahead and get done with this and then move into the master bathroom, then do the hallway, the guest bathroom, the guest bedroom, and then my bedroom. And then I am going to take a break after that. And right here I am pulling out the container so I can actually soak my night guard and clean it. So it's basically a denture cleaner and water and that's basically how you clean a night guard if you're not sure. A night guard is something that I have to wear, especially right now because I'm having a lot of jaw issues, but it's something that I wear at night so that way I'm not clenching my teeth. It kind of protects your teeth and it has helped me with relaxing the muscles in my jaw and since last week the dental thing that happened I'm still having some issues I have a chiropractor appointment on Monday to try to see if my jaw is back out of place so we are going that's what I'm doing I'm letting it soak so that way I can clean it and wear it tonight and I in the shower I just kind of cleaned the inside of the shower door and right on the little step of the the shower partly because when I took a shower after cleaning today I actually as the conditioner was sitting in my hair I actually did clean the shower while I was in there so and I don't know why my cats like to dump all the litter when I just pour new litter in there they like to dump all of it onto the mat so there you saw me basically the second empty of the vacuum cleaner and I'm moving into the hallway which is the easiest room to clean really and truly because it's just a quick dust of the two picture flames and then I vacuum and then we're moving into the bath <laughs>
as mentioned, I am going to do the laundry room tomorrow on Sunday because I still need to do a load of laundry. And as you can see, I have a pile of laundry that needs to be folded. Some of it's from last week. Some of it is my workout gear from that I, wor that I worked out in this week. And yeah, so cleaning of the house is done pretty much. Just laundry is the last thing to do, which I will be doing laundry later today. Don't mind Oreo the wet cat. She is avoiding the neighbor. The neighbors are having some yard work done by yard work. They're having grass sod laid down pretty much. So the work crew is over there on the driveway and she is afraid to be in the garage because of all the stuff out there. And poor thing has nowhere to go since it's raining. So um, although there is a cat house right here on the corner of the, the room but her brother might be in there so i am gonna actually i'm actually gonna take a shower because uh, and then i will get around to folding the laundry later today i the dryer is done for the sofa cover and the chair cover so i need to actually test to see if those are dry yet or if i need a put them on some more I'm fairly certain they're gonna have to go on some more because the, it's canvas pretty much and it's a thicker material and I put it on low heat so we're gonna go test that out then I'm gonna take a shower and then basically rest I'll start editing this video so that way I have less work to do tomorrow it is Monday afternoon <laughs> as I'm filming this part of it and I was finishing up editing just a few minutes ago and I thought I was gonna make it a two day, like all weekend type of reset with me. However, after the BTS concert on Sunday morning, I ended up sleeping all day yesterday, Sunday. So I literally, the concert ended around 6.30. I literally went and moved onto my couch around 6.30 and slept until 6.30 p.m. pretty much. And I was in and out of sleep here and there, you know, ate lunch, ate breakfast, did that. But I did not exercise. I did not do the wipe down of the laundry room. I have not folded laundry. Still, Monday, still haven't folded the laundry. I am never a finisher. I hate emptying out the dishwasher and I hate folding laundry and putting it away. I don't mind getting my elbows deep into dirty dishwater and all of that, but em emptying a clean dishwasher, I just can't do it. <sighs> That's one of my, <laughs> one of the things I have to deal with with myself. But yeah, so I am gonna go ahead and close out this video. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that way you're notified every single time I post a video. I do post videos about cleaning and planning and budgeting and I'm doing a fitness challenge for October. So I've been doing those type of videos, but I hope you join me in the next one. And I apologize for my subscribers for posting this later than normal on Monday, but Sunday happened and I didn't want to do anything. So anyways, thank you everybody and have a great week.